Perot Weinberger re-elected for a fourth term as mayor of Burlington. But this race was extremely tight this time around. NBC5 Zuri Hoffman is live in Qu the Queen City with reaction from the mayor and his closest challenger, Zuri. It was a narrow win for Mayor Moreau Weinberger. It all came down to less than 130 votes, but progressives say despite losing the mayor's race was still a win in their book. Grateful for the opportunity to continue to serve the people uh, of this city. Moreau Weinberger celebrating a narrow victory to serve a fourth term as the mayor of Burlington, getting just under 43% of the votes, while his closest challenger, progressive Max Tracy, got just over 42% a difference of only 129 votes. I'm humbled by the, the closeness of the margin, and I do um, think it means that to succeed going forward, both I and the city council are going to have to really roll up our sleeves. Max Tracy, who will return to his role as city council president, giving remarks after all the votes were counted. You know that Mayor Weinberger will continue to work closely with our city council and with neighbors across our city to help us move closer to a Burlington that works for all of us and will certainly um, work to, to hold him to that vision. Would you say the support of the Progressive Party has grown in Burlington? Absolutely. Um, Ten years ago, we were down to just like two city council seats. Um, in Burlington and since then now we have we have six seats and you know even though we didn't win the mayor's seat this was a pretty significant win in many other ways. Even with Tracy's defeat the director of the Vermont Progressive Party says it was still a great night. Voters approved all of the ballot initiatives it supported including ranked choice voting and maintaining a majority on city council. He's hoping it will send a message to the rest of the state. I think many of the things that we're doing in Burlington um, people are trying to replicate on the statewide level as well. Um, and that's that's really exciting. And I think what this shows is that those issues really do have broad support. As for Weinberger, he says he looks forward to working with Tracy and the progressive dominated Burlington City Council.